All right, I'm going to try to do MCAS in one minute. So starting with any web browser, I'm going to Google Pearson Access Next. I'm going to go to Pearson Access Next. I'm going to select Massachusetts. So I want to get to Massachusetts. If I scroll down, I can sign in right away. But down here, there's an operational site, which is the real testing site, and there's a training site. The training site is the brown site. The operational site is blue. So if I open up the training site, you'll see it's brown. And the operational site, if I open it up and sign in, you'll see that it's blue. Okay, so for infrastructure trial, you'll be in the brown site. Both sites function the same way. One is for the infrastructure trial, one's for the real one. So in either site, under testing, you want to go to students in sessions. Students have already been put in sessions for you. So here you want to add a session to your session list. So if you click on the add a session button, you're going to search by last name for your testing session. So I'm going to be Mrs. Lai and I'm going to type in and as I do these pop up. Today we're going to do ELA so I'm going to click ELA and if I scroll down, down here there's a big blue um, add selected button. If I click on that it's going to add the session here. Here you'll see I have my session, it's ready and I can click on start session. Here I must unlock the test before the kids can start. So before the students try to access the test you'll need to unlock it for them. And throughout the test, you'll want to click this refresh button to see if any students have been uh, kicked out of the test or turned to red or exited. And you'll have to resume them uh, by clicking on this drop down and clicking on resume if they get kicked out of the test.